you doing, honey? I want you to get the full effect, all right? Just let it mix with my body chemistry. <laughs> and I already told you that cologne, swing and a miss. Not what other people say. What other people? Oh, Deacon and Danny and... Oh, well, this girl at the mall said I smelled yummy. Well, I don't care what some skank at the mall thinks, okay? You don't wear cologne for other women. You wear it for me. That's why I have you wear Midnight Steel, because I like it. All right, so take the cologne back to the mall and get your money back, okay, babe? Thanks. <laughs> All right, I'm headed out, and I will pick up your suit from the dry cleaners on my way home, okay? Mm, wow, great. Sounds like I'm gonna be the sharpest dressed guy at Shea Henri. <laughs> you know, my weight class. All right, I'm late. I gotta go. Love you. Oh, yeah? Yeah, real nice. I like it. Well, good. You can keep it. Cool. <clears throat> hey, babe, why don't you come over here and read the sports section? Sounds good. Just, uh, gonna grab a snack first. Just get a snack going. to rub some peanut butter on your wrists. I like peanut butter. I can't believe you sneaking around wearing the cologne that I specifically asked you not to wear. I only wore it when I knew you wouldn't be around. And then when I came home, I washed it off and I put on the stuff you liked. I mean, it never affected you. Oh, I see. So if I went out and had an affair, that'd be okay as long as I washed afterwards? <laughs> Absolutely. I assume you've been doing that for years. No, this is not funny. Oh, come on. I know you want me to feel bad about this, but I don't, okay? You control every aspect of my life, and I'm sick of it. What? That's ridiculous. No, no it isn't. You, you tell me what to wear, uh, what I can eat, what present to get for you, uh, even what I say. Doug, come on. Listen to me, I, I know you like the cologne, but I asked you not to wear it out of respect for me because that's what a marriage is about, respect. I'm the one who has to sacrifice all the stuff. That's what it feels like. That's not true. How about when we first met? I had a certain look that men found attractive. Slutty? <laughs> that was the look, yes. <laughs> Point is, you, you told me it made you insecure, so I gave it up. You should have given it up. You look like a Van Halen groupie. And you used so much hairspray, we couldn't light a match for a week. It was like... The point is, Doug, I stopped for you. You know what? I like this cologne, and I'm taking a stand. Oh, this is where you're going to take a stand on how you smell? How about taking a stand on securing our financial future, finally getting healthy, so you can live past 40? Nah, sticking with smell.